if you want to see more topics on electrical and electronics engineering related videos then check the playlist section of this channel in this video we will see an example on impedance and admittance question for the circuit shown in figure find z eq and use that to find current i let omega is equal to 10 radian per second solution first of all we will copy this given circuit now here we can see this is connected in series so this will be this is equal to minus j or we can directly solve this in calculator so first we will write minus j14 plus j25 minus j14 plus j25 minus j14 plus i into 25 so it is 11j 11j now this 11j is in parallel with this 16 ohm so here we can write 11j parallel with 16 ohm so this is equal to 11j into 16 divided by 11j plus 16 11 into i into 16 divided by 11 into i plus 16 so it is equal to 5.13 5.13 so plus 7.46 j now here this will be this whole value will be this much so let's copy this circuit again let's copy this circuit from here we can erase this much part now here this impedance will be this impedance will be 5.13 plus 7.46 j and its unit will be ohm here also this is ohm now here we can see these three are connected in series so therefore their total impedance will be z is equal to 4 plus j20 plus 5.13 plus 7.46 j so therefore z is equal to 4 plus i into 20 4 plus i into 20 plus 5.13 plus 7.46 j so this is equal to 9.13 9.13 then plus 27.46 j 27.46 j and since it is impedance so its unit will be ohm now we got the value of impedance we also have the value of voltage we have to find the current value so i is equal to v upon z i is equal to v upon z the value of voltage is 12 at an angle 0 degree divided by impedance z value is this value so let's copy this from here we can directly solve this in calculator so 12 at an angle 0 divided by 9.13 plus 
into j so this is in rectangular form in polar form this will be shift 2 3 so it is 0 0.414 0 0.414 at an angle minus 71 point minus 71.60 and since it is current so its unit will be ampere and it is degree now we got the value of current i in phasor domain so let's find the value of now we got the value of zeq so let's write the value of zeq so this z is the value of zeq then the value of i is equal to this value 0 0.414 at an angle minus 71.60 degree ampere so this is how we can find impedance and current in ac circuit don't forget to like share and subscribe to this channel and also check out the other videos on this channel and thanks for watching